Hello everyone and welcome for episode 3 of Yes, Your Grace. So, this is the final week before the big night. It's our last chance to deal with the Radovian posts. Oh yes, the Queen wanted to see you, Your Grace. Thank you, Audrey. So, we have two camps left and we have only one week to deal with them, so hopefully I find a way to deal with them quickly. Your Grace! Redovia attacked again, but their squad didn't stand a chance against us. I would like to think that it will be a while before they decide to attack one of our villages again, Your Grace. Alright, and I have no choice but to send you to the post and destroy them. Alright. Uh, Lady Edda. Your Grace, you called for me. I have found your thief. I have put the man in the, in the dungeons, where he belongs. Your Grace, if I may, can I take him with me? Dubai. Of course, do whatever you may desire with him. He's all yours. Don't worry, Your Grace, I'll show him where his place is. And of course, you can count on my help uh, during your upcoming battle. I don't have much to offer, but it's better than nothing. I'm glad we became allies, Lady Edda. It's good to have you on our side. It's my pleasure. That's all. So we got 60... 60 men. Thank you. Let me know if you need anything. Bye bye. We have the crazy guy. Your Grace, I'm starting to think that perhaps you are involved. That, what I'm saying. Why would I say this? Why Why would I tell someone you... You know that... That 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 that, 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 that they know. I, I better leave. I, I, I can, right? Yeah. Just go. Our daughter is back. Father. Lord Sulia, you finally came out. Can you please come and meet me at the wall when you get a chance? I wanted to talk to you. Of course, I will see you there. Peasant. Your Grace, I came here to ask you for help. My father is very sick with fever. Help me, please. He's pale as a ghost and he shakes and sweats all the time. You have tried treating the fever with cold water, now poultice of butter, onion and garlic. We have given him a concoction of warm wood and mint. Agates, we even tried letting the bad blood with, lich, uh, with the leeches. I'm afraid he might not last another night. Your Grace, if we had a court witch available, she could handle these diseases. That's true, you should put word out that we are looking for one. As for your father... Uh, I do have the medicine. And I guess... It would be quite evil to give her the, uh, the medicine as a test subject to see if the guy dies or survives and if it's uh, an actual good medicine you could uh, buy more from the merchant so I'm gonna use your dad as a subject for science of course Boy. this should help your father it's something stronger that you will, wouldn't find on a rural stall really? that will probably help thank you my grace your grace papa here papa here I come Oh well, we'll see if he survives. Oh How can I be a service? Tell me about oh the level. Huh? Is our army Eba. ready? Eba. Okay, Eba. nothing Eba. interesting. Eba. Bye bye. Eba. Let's go. Uh, Talis, 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 Talis. Let's go see uh, Sidani or Salia first. Pumpkin? Your Grace? Yes! Uh, are you ready for the wedding? Yes! I just had one question I may ask. I must ask Your Grace. Yes. May Smudge come to the wedding too? But, I guess. But you need to keep him very close to you, Sedani. I always keep him close, Your Grace. Fine, you can come. Don't forget to say goodbye to Lursulia. She's leaving right after the wedding. Yes, I also need to say goodbye to Dusty. It's going to be alright, Pumpkin. Your Grace? How will you do? Salia, wanna fight? We are almost ready for the wedding. It's almost, 
it's all either. It looks like it's go going to be quite a, ba a banquet. Yeah, for, we, for you it will, not for Lusuria. I still can't believe she's leaving. Hopefully she can learn to be friends with Prince Evo. I don't think she wants to. I know. I wish we had more time to find a prince, but this is the way it has to be. Stay safe. Don't do anything silly, Nassali. Do I ever? Do you ever? Uh, let's go to the bed. Nope. <laughs> she wants to decide which dress. Nope. King Talis. We're almost ready for the wedding. We've been preparing for this for weeks. We've booked a florist. I bought, I bought throne decorations. We'll have a live band. There was no need. I just want it to be over and done with. Who cares about some stupid decorations? It's the vows that are important. I hate weddings. People forget what they are really about. Oh well. It's going to be quite a party either way. I'll see you there. Yes, yes, very well. Do you find anything yet? Nope. Okay. Bye bye. Uh, let's talk to our daughter. And pet the cat. If it's here. Do we have any allies we can talk to? Alright, Lord Sulia. I'm sorry about this. Oh, it's you. You, want, you wanted to see me? I'm sorry I shouted at you, father. I didn't mean it when I called you stupid. I just wish things were different. I just wish I'd spend the past couple of days being with you, not angry at you. I know, darling. I know. I love you, father. I love you too. I love you more than anything in this world, Luli. I know. You hate it when I call you that, but you're still my Luli. It's alright, Papa. I'll miss you calling me Luli. Your mother has prepared one hell of a wedding. Yes, I'd better get ready before she finds me. I'll see you at the party. Dusty? Good girl. I'm gonna miss you. Yeah. Alright. Let's go decide which dress. Which dress our daughter will have. Or I can just end the day in the no dress. Will be chosen. Alright. Let's look at them first. Never mind. So we have a uh, cheap dress. I guess medium. Uh, medium expensiveness dress and uh, maybe too much dress no no it's not the uh, most pretty darling how are the wedding preparations going everything is ready apart from one last thing choosing a dress i let you do the honors well let's start with the one you want oh look at this puffy decorated piece of art isn't it beautiful 50 gold is nothing for such e e elegance. What do you say then? This is the one, correct? Uh, let's see how the others compare. I will tell you how the others compare. They don't. Ah, this is obviously not an option. I found it in a chest of my old clothes. It even smells. It, must, it won't cost a coin, but what would everyone think? So, the puffy one. No. But honestly, I think the one in the middle is the best looking one. Because this one is too much with the... Uh, the, frown, the, the crown and the... Uh, the massive... Uh, oof, what do you call it? I don't know what you call it. But oh well, let's go with the middle one. This is a middle ground gown. Nothing special, but for 25 pieces of gold... <laughs> 25, I don't have enough. <laughs> Can't expect too much. So, what do you think? The puffy one, yes? Uh, I think this gown actually looks quite nice. We can't afford it, darling. Uh, the puffy one? 
Can I call... Can I call you? Or will you come next week? <laughs> Wait, you're not going anywhere. We have to address to pick. Uh, <laughs> I think this is game over. <laughs> oh well. I am very sorry, Sonia. <laughs> I said I would be a good... A good father, but I'm afraid because we can't afford this. Yeah, we can't afford this. Uh, the puffy one. <laughs> My daughter is gonna hate me so much, but I'm sorry. I have literally no choice. I am one gold short of uh, having the nice nice dress. I'm very sorry. But surely this is a joke! Oh come on darling, this not this one is not even white! I shouldn't have let you pick the dress. I'm very sorry, Asaya. I am so sorry. Words cannot describe how sorry I am. Oh well. Hopefully she will forgive me. And now we have enough money, of course. Uh, save and continue. So, let me just say, we didn't get rid of every every camps, and she has the most smelly dress. I, I mean, the color looks like looks nice from here, but oh, well, let's do the evil voice. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed by the beauty of my uh, my new wife here. I'll enjoy the company, I'm sure, and. Uh, Oof! I, I, damn it. Uh, I guess we could laugh. <laughs> Look at him. I guess the smell of a fine wine is all the youngster needs to fall down. Or the smell of his wife. Get up. You're making a, you're making a fool out of yourself, boy. Uh, like I said, company, my wife. Uh, yeah, yeah, so. Here's to that. Forgive me, uh, father said I should make some kind of speech. I wasn't sure what to say, but I hope I, I didn't offend you. You look... Uh, that's an is interesting choice of dress, by the way. Dot dot dot. Oh. Oof. I mean, every dialogue choice is... We got Evo. He's a good lad, you know. He's not that bad. Or you will get used to him. You have to. Or he's still better than a barbarian. Uh, I guess I would just say the first one. I won't let you marry someone inappropriate. You know that, right, Lusoria? A bit clumsy, to be sure, but he will grow, up, grow out of that. <laughs> Poor girl. Your Grace! Man from Mordovia! You, you didn't manage to clear their post? I hope this is nothing serious. A nearby village was raided. They've kidnapped the blacksmith's children. We'll deal, we'll deal with this later. I'll have my general check this out as soon as I have time. Yes, Your Grace. I'll be on my way, if you will excuse us. Excuse me. Talis! About the Rodovians. This seals the deal, Eric. You get the army, I get full access to the archives, and of course, uh, Evo gets a wife. I wasn't sure if you would honor your bargain, Eric. Why would you think that? You're a family man, aren't you? I didn't think you would want to let your daughter leave the nest just yet. Believe me, the other option doesn't seem any better. And the party went on. Everyone was Busy eating fancy food, drinking at the finest wine. I looked for him everywhere. I've stirred up every pot, even in the kitchen. Don't worry, we'll find him, Sadani. The salad looks surprisingly flavorsome. What? What is it? A Kaladis recipe? Ha! Ah. Did you see her dress? She could have worn a rag, and you would have been, and you wouldn't have been able to tell the difference. These snails are extremely undercooked. Fuck! What snails? That's not part of the menu. Smudge! <laughs> oh well, someone's gonna get the virus. The party went better than anyone expected. 
Listen, I think I've wasted. <coughs> uh, uh, I, I spent enough time with the guests. I really need to get back to the archive, so if you don't mind, I will take my leave, Eric. Talia's ha, Your Grace. Leaving so early. Toast, toast, drink at least one more with us. See, perfect timing, Your Grace. Will I get some peace after that? To the young couple. Until the ill fated toast that is. Cough, cough. Eric, do something! Uh, uh, go! Move! Talis! Talis was found on the ground before anyone had a chance to react. He, he's not. Is he. Father? Yes. Your Grace! Father! How, how could you? Eric, how could you ever allow this to happen? Eric, you have accommodated us in your castle, which we are grateful for, but this? This is beyond our beliefs. You have failed as a host and are responsible for the events of tonight. The king of Atana, Talis, is dead. Evo, your Talis' is only son. You have no choice but to take the burden of the crown upon yourself. Go ahead, Evo. Ivo. Eric, I can't believe this. You leave me no choice. As the new king of Atana, my first order is to withhold the armies that my father promised to you. And I will not be paying for your agents. Eric, the king of Davern, you are responsible for Talis' death, unless otherwise can be proven upon a royal trial. Until then, Davern will not receive support from Etsana. Losuria, pack your things. I'm taking my father home. Ah, wait, no, you can't do that. Your grace, the wedding is over. The vows were said. The marriage still stands. Have courage, my darling. Oof. Oh well. To make an agent available. To hire an agent. Well, I'm gonna need Stan a lot, I feel like. Alright. So, so we're making... Four gold per week. I guess that's fine. All right, let's save and continue. So the king is dead. We have lost our army. And the barbarians are coming for us. Everything is going well. And that's all I can recall, your grace. Considering how much I drank that night, it's quite remarkable I remember anything. Surely you can remember more than that. Did you see anything suspicious? Anyone wandering off where they shouldn't? Lady Lena was staring... At Lord Suilla's just a bit too much if you ask me, but nothing else, I'm afraid. And we are glad your daughter has been found safe and well. I think we have examined all the guests, uh, your grace. And we haven't heard anything out of the ordin ordinary. Talis' soldiers will the main bulk of our army. Solving the murder case will surely convince Ivo to, Ivo to, aid, us, to aid us in battle. Whoever did poison Talis must have planned it, uh, planned it out to the smallest detail. If you find any leads, do let me know, Your Grace. Talis wasn't one, wasn't an, anyone's favorite person, but you, you'd need to have a very good reason to murder the king of Atana. We mustn't lose focus on our main goal, however. Radovia won't wait for us to resolve this. In this situation, we shan't rely on Talis. Talis is uh, Ivo's army. We need to seek help from other lords in case we, ki we can't convince a Ivo in time. As for the army, we will need to reach out to neighboring lords, make allies, sign treaties. It sounds like you're in quite a pickle, Your Grace. You're still here. Speaking of allies, treaties, etc. I have a hefty army waiting for orders. I can throw in some extra gold and supplies to aid you too. Th 230 men and 6 gold. What's the catch? You do want something in return, I presume. Lurus. From Pandal. 
your grace. He stopped delivering spices to my associates in Branca. Turmeric, caraway, and ice, foods as bland as hell without all these. Persuade lawyers to renew the deliveries and my men will aid you in battle, your grace. I will see what can be done. Yeah, very well, your grace. Now that's a start. We should invite lawyers over, see what we can do. I have also marked areas of interest on the map. It might be worth checking them. Maybe we can find a piece of gold or two. We don't know when Rodovia will show up, but we need to start preparing for the battle as soon as possible. I have made a note of things we can do on our weekly summary, Your Grace. We should be able to deny payments from our, for our agent. We can't expect them to work if you don't pay them, but at least we can save a coin. Maintaining our army will also cost us supplies. It only gets more diff difficult from now on, Your Grace. Oh, and here are the petitioners. Perhaps the servant will shine some lights, some light on the case. Can now, yeah, can now use the map to explore. Help locals. Let's look at the map. Send agents. Simply click and select location. Okay, we got Luba, Wallami, Xano. General. Ooh, the north, the north post was craw crawling with Redovian scum, your grace. We have managed to, dispa to dispatch most of them. Alright, that's good. Banker, I hear that your treasure is, isn't in the best uh, spot. No, thank you. Servant. You have called for me, your grace? Tell me what happened during the wedding night. I, I don't know, your grace. I was, was only bringing food and drinks, uh, like I was told. I'm so sorry, your grace. I swear, I swear, I did nothing by the gods. Please, 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 don't punish me. I swear, I didn't know these drinks were poisoned. I only picked them up from the kitchen and brought them to the ceremony. I swear, I didn't know, your grace. Get it together. If you don't tell me right now what happened, I'll have your head chopped off. How did you know how to give this one? How did you know to give this one to Talis? I swear, I didn't do anything. I didn't know. I'm always told to serve the kings first, your grace, and that's what I did. But the dungeon guard might might know something. He was mentioned he he has mentioned he saw someone in the wine cellar that night. I don't know anything else though, I swear. I believe that narrows our search then. You may go, but don't leave Davern until after the royal trial. <laughs> Thank you, Your Grace. What do you want, peasant? Your Grace, my son, a disgrace to the family. I sent him to, the, to gather some brushwood in the forest. Turns out he's too dumb to find a way back home. Do you think you could help us find him? I mean, there's no rush. Nah. Yeah. There's no way I can help. You could always ask the neighboring, neighboring villagers. Ask around. Oh, it's fine. I didn't like him anyway. <laughs> uh, Audrey. You should see what's going on with those spices. Would you like to invite Lurus to your grace? Sure. Let's invite him. Just open the ally allies panel, your grace. Lurus can be invited from here. Dear father, you have arrived. Atana is nothing like da Daver. The vast streets of Hagos expand endlessly, it seems. Asalia would love to get lost in there, in here. The journey was tiring, but the views have compensated for everything. Sidani would have made your ears fall off with her questions if she saw the landscapes here. The cliffs and rocks span across the whole of Atana. It all makes you feel very small. On top of all these rocks, there lies Hagos, like a nest, looking over everything. Now I understand why they used the griffin as their banner. I'm really sorry for the last weeks we spent together. Hog mother for me. Boy, boy. Ah yes, Atana can be very pretty. Boy, boy. But also very dangerous. You don't want to be caught out in the rural windstorms. Boy, boy. You should reply to Lorsulia. Tell her it's good to hear from her. Boy, boy. Of course. What should I ask her about? Mm. Hmm, I'm not sure. Maybe the girls have some questions. Of course. Let me know when you're ready to write the letter. Alright, map. Can I send my general? 
Yes, I can. How, m how long? One week. Alright. Uh, allies. To prepare the battle, you need to make friends. King Ivo. King Teres is dead. Got Grego. Vialit. Got Lena. Uh, Ada, she gave us her, uh, her soldiers, I think. Uh, let's invite Lurus. Alright. Let's talk to our daughters to get a message for uh, Ursulia. Alright. Uh, Gardens first. This paving stone looks like it was moved. If I could get something sharp and thin to lift it. A sword would be too thick. It needs to be something smaller. Because there's a... There's a clue. Yes, father? I hate that you had to see that. Yeah. The wedding didn't really go to plan, did it? No. What happened was terrible. The wedding went fairly well until then. Although Lursulia's dress was rather embarrassing, I can't believe you chose that one for her. I'd never let you choose my dress. <laughs> well, we'll see about that. She sent a letter. She said uh, you would love it there. I'm sure I would if I ever got to leave this castle. You would be able to leave the castle if you behave better. Yeah, right. When you write to Louis, can you ask her about uh, uh, Ivo? What is he like? I just can't imagine having to live here and live with some strange man. If there is any free space in the letter, I will ask her. Thank you. Stay safe. Of course I will, father. Council chamber. Let's go see our pumpkin. Audrey said I can review the evidence here. Let's take a look. Okay, no evidence. Obviously, uh, anything Talis left? Maybe no. All right, just talk. Let's talk to our pumpkin. Your Grace, how are you doing? Is everything all right, Sidan? Last week's event were quite distressing for all of us. I do not understand why this would happen. How could someone eat smudge? Dusty is gone, and now smudge is what? Smudge is six feet underground. But then again, I couldn't dig that deep, so I just covered him with a rock. It's so boring here without Luli. You promised you convince her to stay. Is she even going to visit us? I don't know if she will. Ivo, Ivo is very upset after lo losing his father. I think we need to give uh, to give them some time. Could we vis visit him? Visit them one day? I think we could, just not now. She wrote a letter. What do you think we should uh, reply to her? Oh, yes! Tell her I'm taking her bed, Chamber. Oh, mother, let me. Oh, oh, or no. Tell her Asalia read her diary. Oh, no, that's not right. I have very, very limited space pumpkin. So, can I only say one thing? Yes. Oh, this is too big of a decision. I will come to you later, when I think of something good enough. Fine, don't worry about it too much. We'll write more letters. But the first one is the most important. Well, come and see me whenever you're ready. Goodbye. Oh, wait. Uh, let's talk to the dungeon guy. After we talk to our wife. I think I can pick up needles. Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, these could be useful. Darling? What happened at the wedding was awful. I still can't, I still can't believe Talis was poisoned. It could have been me. Do you think Lord Surya will be alright? Ivo seems very upset. I'm sure she will be fine. As soon as we find out who's responsible, who, uh, who's responsible for this, we can renew our treaty with Ivo. Could have done something so terrible. 
must have been one of the guests. We have gathering we are gathering evidence. When we have enough proof, we will call the royal trial. Alright, darling. Let's hope it gets resolved quickly. Ah, I think I'll get some rest. I'll let you rest. After I ask you this question. Our daughter has arrived safely. She seems to like Atana. I'm quite jealous of her. Atana is a beautiful place. Their castle is much better than ours too. Hey, that hurts. I hope she will learn her way around soon. I'm sure she will die. When you write to her, tell her I'm sending my best wishes to both of them. Ask her how she's dealing with all of these new things and what what has she been doing without her sisters. Of course, I don't want to write her a full length book. I'll see what I can do. Thank you, my darling. Fine, I will stay here. Let's go back to the um, to the gardens. Pick up the the thing. Crack. This paving stone looked like it was moved. Right, if I use the needles here. I got it. A piece of paper. You're a bit far to use the needles, but okay. A piece of paper. Oh, it appears to be some sort of letter. It has a map of the castle it reads. Find wine in the cellar. Mix it with seven drops of the substance in a glass. Be seen by no one. It looks like it looks like an instruction letter to whoever poured poison in Talis's wine. It's beautifully decorated with some flowers. We don't usually decorate our letters. It would be too costly. Maybe you can trace these drawings to the person who has written this. It reads, okay. Let's talk to... Let's talk to our wife, I guess. I have found this letter. I have found this. I have found some clues that might lead us to the person who's behind Talis's death. What have you found? A letter. I have found this letter in the gardens. It contains instructions about pouring poison in a wine glass, and a map of our castle. The letter seems to be decorated with flowers, like in the olden days. How can we trace this letter to wh whoever wrote it? This is a very important piece of inform of evidence, Eric. Ask a general if he knows of anyone who decorates their letters in such a manner. If he's available, he'll probably be at the wall. But he's not available. Uh, let's talk to the prison guard. And then talk to Audrey again. How can I help your grace? I've heard you know something about Talis' death. Tell me what happened uh, during the wedding night. The servant said you saw some. Saw some? No. But I found this. Some kind of tooth, I think. Hmm. And how did you obtain this item? I was guarding the prisoners, your grace. Well, I might have had that drink or two with the other guards. It was a time to celebrate, after all. I never left the dungeons, of course. Until the end of my watch, that is. What, hap what happened then? I was doing the usual check of all the cellars, yes. A little unsteady, but that's where I found the tooth. Where exactly do you find this? In the wine cellar, your grease. I didn't see anyone going in there, though. Well, they probably crept in while you were busy drinking. I'm sorry, your grease. I really didn't mean for anything bad to happen. Alright, do you have anything to say? A big pointy animal or monster tooth? We don't have big creatures around the castle. Someone must have lost it. Can I use it? Never mind. I'm just gonna go on the loop to show it to the Radovian guy. Let's talk to our wife again. Hello, wife. I am back. Darling? Uh, blah, blah, blah. What have you found? An animal, an animal tooth. This animal tooth is a very exotic thing. We don't have dragons anywhere near Tavern. A guard found it in the wine cellar. It could be from a merchant or someone who's dealt with big beasts before. Maybe take it to a hunter, see if he can tell where exactly this tooth came from. We don't have a hunter in the castle. And ask Audrey to put the word out that we're looking for one. That's all. Bye bye. Let's go talk to Audrey again. 
one room. Audrey, I need your services. Uh, investigation progress. I have prepared a table for you with the overview of all our evidence. When we find evidence item, they will be shown on there, together with information we have gathered about each one of them. When question lords about the items we have found so far. Well, wait, let's write the letter first to Norsulia. Of course, what should I write? Uh, <laughs> tell her she has forgotten her slippers. Ask her about Ivo. What is he like as a husband? How is he dealing with his father's death? And say that I wish to give him my condo my condolences. Mention that we were we are working hard on finding the murderer. Very well, Your Grace. I will write her a letter. We should anticipate a reply within a couple of weeks. Uh, let's go to the council chamber. Analyze our evidence and end the day here. So we have a letter. We need to seek an expert about uh, writing letters and question subjects for the tooth. Okay, we need to get the hunter. So now let's ask Audrey to do just that. Uh, blah, 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 blah. But I guess not. Oh well. Uh, can I show it to you? No. Okay. Alright, let's end the day. Your army needs food and supplies to say maintain and ready for battle. The bigger the, uh, the army you have, the more supplies it will cost to maintain it. Great. To pay the army upkeep, simply, simply click on the pay button and you will see the cost below added. And they, if you don't pay the army, you will lose some soldiers. Okay, we lose four soldiers. We have enough supplies for now, I think. Uh, we have enough contentment for now. General will be available during the battle. What battle? Uh, training ground. This is going to be very useful. And stables too. I think long term we need to start now with the uh, with getting a big army, and then we we'll focus on uh, on the rest. Anyway, thank you everyone for watching, and I will see you on the next episode of Yes, Your Grace. Bye, guys.